Thank you. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Chaos Draft here on Magic Online. Doomsday 1981. Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. G -g -g ghost and we're gonna do another chaos draft i don't know if i said that before the doomsday sub mike b was here but i don't know if he's coming back usually staying awake for two hours is usually the limit so Freaky ghosts. Yeah. I'm about to bust. <laughs> All right, so seven of eight. Let's, uh... I have no idea what the deck list is on the screen. I saw a half dolphin, half man, and grease one time. <laughs> Alright, well that's a thing, I guess. Oh, a swift blade vindicator. Yeah, I don't care about that. City Watch Sphinx is nice. Deadweight is nice. I think we're just taking 5-4 flyer that surveils too. That's pretty good. Maybe this capture sphere will come back. And then there's like two cards for other people, but I'm taking the blue card. Noblest of War after we pass? Wow, that would be insane. I might just have to take the Noblest of War to be quite honest. This card is really strong. I mean, it's basically just a 5-4 flyer that gives your all your other attacking creatures plus 2, plus 0. The problem is that, like, oh wow, Curve with the Spite Mare. Yes. Yes. The, the problem is that five red or white forces you to be basically in red and white. Fire at will, also pretty hard to cast if we're not red or white. Very good, though. Uh, I think he might be coming. I think he's on his way. Recumbent Bliss is pretty good. Actually, it's very good. I kind of like just Recumbent Bliss. Don't you dare not take that Spite Mare. Wow, really? I'm going to take the Bliss. Ah, uh, I feel bad. You missed two picks so far. It's okay. Mike came back, guys. He made it. He just had to get some, some, ice, some, some more ice. Okay, so we got countervailing winds. I don't care about that. Tenacious hunger. Hunger? I think his name is Hunter. Why did I say hunger? Hunter? As long as creature has an egg one, it gets death touch. Uh, what does this card do? Enchanted creature you control when it enters battlefield, all damage that would be dealt this turn to you or permanence you control is dealt to the enchanted creature instead. I'm just gonna take it to Sandblast. Sandblast is pretty fantastic. Again with the sandblast, eh? It's good. It's a good. It's a good the card. What was your other white pick? A recumbent bliss. Okay. You gain a life every turn. You know how much that adds up. At least once. That's it's pretty much. It doesn't. That's a lot. What is this? Three one for five? Oh, it's got first strike, I guess. Ooh. Look at the top four cards of your library. You reveal up to two instant or sorcery cards. Put them into your hand. Eh. Deputy of acquittal seems pretty sweet. That's just about a dick through time, right? Yeah, it's a better dig through that. <laughs> yeah, straight up. Oh, man. I'm going to just take this deputy of acquittals. Oh, my God. Did you hear that? Yeah, it was pretty loud. Oh, Jesus. I'm basically dead.
How's that working out for you? Reading that card? Yeah. Okay. I read it just fine. I read it just fine. <laughs> Who do you think you are? This is a little big star. What does this guy do? I don't know. It's a 2-2 two, two for 3. Whenever a spirit or arcane is cast, you put a key counter on it. At the beginning of your end step, if there are two or more key counters on it, you may flip it. Okay. Remove a key counter from Jiraku, the interloper. Counter target spell unless it's controller paste. Okay, so it's just mana leaks. You can read it as a 3 mana 2-2 two, two, because that's all it'll ever that's be. That's all it will ever be in this format. Uh, No. Does one of you start attacking or blocking spirit? Oh, God. Gotta love Kamigawa. I kind of like just taking this in case we get a spirit or arcane spell, then it just turns into a 3-4 with uh, mana leaks on it. You have like a bunch of key counters on it. But you're always going to have two, because whenever you cast a spirit or arcane card, you put, put it on there. Does it count itself? No. <laughs> it's a human. Why would it count itself? What's wrong with you? Oh, I like this. I like 5-5 five, five for 5. Good talk. Good as long talk. as you control a what? A blue creature. Okay. A blue creature. A blue chi, if you will. Easy. Old blue chi. Easy enough. You're easy enough. Frank reading upside. It's so hard. Like, why don't they turn them? Why don't they have a way to fix this? So I'm just like, I don't understand. Why? Like, why? Just why? I don't know why you turn your head. It's easier just to read it upside down. You're easier to read upside down. Huh. Skyskip is not terrible. Also, there are spirits in other sets. You know, it's not just this set that has spirits, so. You're still never going to flip it. That's rude of you. Jenny, have a good afternoon, buddy. Thanks so much for hanging out. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. Never gonna flip it, never gonna flip it, never gonna flip it. Remember that? Remember that? Was that TLC? No. I don't know who that was. No, that was the Thuggish Rogers Ball. <laughs> so Mike was like... <laughs> Mike got Bone Thugs in Harmony, the Thuggish Ruggish Bone, confused with Thuggish Ruggish Ball. And I was like, I can't tell if that's a meme, if like you're making a, a joke somehow, or if you literally just got the name wrong. I think you literally just got the name wrong. It's either Dive Down, which is kind of like a counter spell, or we can just, actually it's probably just Shining Aerosaur. 3-4 Flyer for 5 is just fine. Pack Beast taps up the two dudes we could also take Guildgate in case we want to splash a red card which I don't hate just want to say thanks for the content you produce I struggle with depression and PTSD you're in struggle really struggle wait hold on what but it's little things that can make it all like how carefree you seem and how much entertainment you provide it's an escape from the day dude Badger I had no idea man thank you so much for saying so I really appreciate it I'm so sorry you have to deal with that dude I mean I've also been someone who suffers from depression and anxiety uh, intermittently in my life it's definitely it's definitely a a real pain in the ass to put it uh to put it one way this guy is a 3-2 for 4 that gives a blue creature shroud that actually seems pretty good badger you are awesome man you are one of the most supportive people of of the content i make and i really really appreciate it and thank you so much for saying so and i'm glad i could help at least in some capacity Maybe if you're lucky, Mike will take you to the Thuggish Ruggish Ball. <laughs> this guy's not even a spirit, man. I can't even cast him and get a bonus from it. Banishing Knack is good? What the hell is Banishing Knack? I think I can hear Hunter in the background just chewing his little feet. It's the first of the month. Wake up, wake up, wake up. It's the first of the month. Is Sissy's ring good? It's okay. Undo is insane, right? Return two creatures to the owner's hand. 
Yeah, that seems pretty good. There's so there's cards in like in Visions that are like, wow, this card is absolutely hot trash, and there's other cards where it's like, wow, this card's unbelievably low. Like Fire Blast is a common. Undo is a common, but then you have like, when this comes into play, pay 16 life, or you got to return it to your hand, and you're like, all right, well that's weird. Yeah, I'm just gonna take this. Undo seems broken. Yeah, it's pretty under cost for balancing two things. We got a young bay wielder. A young bay wielder? Mm hmm. What the hell's that? Where are you looking? Marwin. M oh, a young bay wielder. I yeah. gotcha. I gotcha. Got that baby. I don't know how she's going to shoot that arrow, but, you know. I think we're gonna take yeah, I think it's I think it's big jugs. I think it's Juggerino. How do you feel about big jugs? They're alright. <laughs> They're alright. You heard it here first, folks. Mike thinks big jugs are alright. Friend damage that we dealt to Tron train pronghorn. It's a one one though. Why do I It's a one one though. Why do I Tap up to two creatures? This bounces two creatures, everything Thank has to do with you. two creatures. No, what's that I got? It's our seventh anniversary, and it's Mike and my birthday. That's nuts. Wow. You guys both have the same birthday? That's insane. Happy birthday to both of you guys. <sighs> Whenever this is going to do return up to that many target permanents that player controls to their owner's hand. It's still a 1-1, one -one, though. I mean, I guess it's the best 1-1 one -one in the pack, right? Sure. Okay. It's not great. Part the Veil. Not, not to be confused with Part the Water Veil. Return all creatures you control to their owner's hand. <sighs> nope, never want to do that. 2-2 two, two for 4 with flying. Return land you control to its owner's hand. Counter target spell. That's actually very good. 2-2 two, two flyer for 4 is fine. And then you get to just have mana leaks on deck. I guess it's me metallic rebuke, I guess. Because that's not a 2 mana counter. Or not a, not a counter for that, needs, that they need to pay 2 for. It's a counter they need to pay 3 for. So... Good talk. Oh, Kamigawa, you so crazy. You ain't wrong. Look at this octopus. I'm sorry. Look at this mausoleum wanderer. Oh, spontaneous mutation's not bad. This is a spirit. I kind of like taking this because it's a spirit. You need like three counters on that. You need two. Yeah. If there are two or more counters, you need to pick two spirit spells and it makes it a three, four. No, we're just taking this guy's just a two, two for two anyway. Hey man, you ready for them Buffalo boys? Yeah, boy. Okay. I eat them up. That's why. Well, that's I don't the... eat them all. Okay, don't do that. All of them. It's going to make my nose runny worse, though. It's going to make my nose runny worse. It's the first of the month. Wake, wake up. up. Wake up. Wake up. Is that Bone Things in Harmony? Uh, I don't think so. No. Who is that? Google it. It's totally Bone Thugs and Harmony. God, man, you don't even know. You don't even know. You don't know the name of the songs. You don't know who sings them. It is Bin Thugs. Thank you. Relax and Sam. Thank you so much for the reset. Welcome back. Change my name from Iron Chef. <gasps> Iron Chef Sammy, what's going on, my dude? Relax and Sam is good. I like it. I like it. It's got a real laid back vibe to it. For obvious reasons. The other time where X is the number of artifacts you control. God, these these cards are all hot garbage. It's probably just a shroud and can't be blocked. That, that card actually seems decent. Cast a spell on your opponent. If you control fewer creatures than each opponent, create three one ones for for three. That seems really good. Yeah, I'm game. 
I'm game for three one one boys. I recently gave the Nightfall Saga a reread as I haven't read since the, the the writing didn't hold up at all. Death and Return of Superman is okay. I I feel that way about a lot of uh, '90s comics. Yeah, Disciple Law Pro Red. It's a one two though, so I don't really care. I'm probably just gonna take this because it could be very good again. Or we could take Pit Trap. Pit Trap's actually good too. What do you think? What's Pit Trap do? Sack it to destroy a target attacking creature without flying. Seems good. I like that. Yeah, it's good. 90s was more um, fashion over function in terms of comic books. It was really depressing and it gave comics a bad name, I think. Uh, in the sense that, like, you were far more concerned with having bigger muscles and bigger guns. And like then 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 like actually telling good stories and it was a really dark time for comics actually. Uh the school of Rob what's his name? Rob Liefeld. Yes. Yeah. Backs can't do that, Rob. Yeah, sure they can. <laughs> Rob, where are your feet? <laughs> well, I don't like drawing feet. Oh, okay. Uh Dream Tides. Can creatures on a, creatures in general, at the beginning of each player's upkeep, that target player that player may choose any number of tapped non green creatures they control and pay two for each. So it's just never... Green creatures can never untap? That seems insane. I'm just going to take this. If they play a green deck, I'm like, your green guys never untap again. Your green guys never untap. Green goes never untap. Nah, it's one of these two. I was trying to make a green goes joke, but then it just didn't work. It definitely didn't work. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. This deck's looking good, though. I'm okay with it. I took the I took the other one over flight. A lot of our guys are going to have flying anyway. Flying, flying, flying. Um, we, have, we already have Whisper Silk to make things unblockable, so I'm not super concerned with flying. Yeah, none of these. Are, this, is a, this, is an arcane, this is an instant spell. This is an arcane spell, so we can actually cast this to put a counter on our Kalara Jushi. And then it'll just go back to our hand. Brilliant. I agree. Okay, those last like six cards were actually terrible for us, so. Marshall's Anthem. Ooh. This card is bonkers. Creatures you control get plus one, plus one. So at, at the most, four mana for an Anthem. Great. When it enters the battlefield, return up to X target creature cards from your graveyard to the battlefield where X is the number of times. So if you play this for six, it's just a reanimate spell with an with an Anthem attached. If you play it for eight, you get two guys back. Like, in the late game, this card's busted. I'm really hoping this Banisher comes back, but I have my doubts. I mean, it is the first of the month, though, so it's possible. It's actually not. You don't know. My credit card expires soon, so remind me to renew myself when I get a new card. I will. I will. I'll let you know. Hey man, it's fine if your dinners come from a box or a bag. That's totally that's totally reasonable. Man, Mike's got some boogies coming, boys. Oh, Ojitai. Flying vigilance when a dragon you control attacks, tap target only and permanent opponent controls that permanent doesn't untap. Yeah, this seems great. I mean it's a five six flyer rare flying vigilance dragon that taps things down. We could also have a second sandblast, but I'm just gonna take the big fat bomby guy. Even if it was just 7 mana for a 5-6 flyer, that'd be good enough. Right, but now it has Vigilance and it taps things down forever. How them bugs? I hear if you eat these, no, if you eat no, these silica no. packets, that it helps with your running Shut nose, my dude. My money. One disgruntled no spite mare bug. <laughs> that was like, dude, that was like 20 minutes ago, my dude. I appreciate it though. I still appreciate the. Uh, I think it's just Radiant Purge. Exile a multicolor creature or multicolor enchantment. 
Yeah, it's kind of narrow. Yeah, but like, what else is there? It's Vial of Dragonfire deals two damage to a creature. You could take. That actually might be better. Uh, target tap at a creature opponent controls. You enchant a creature plus one plus three. That's actually not Shut terrible. Shut up and take my money. One still mad bug. <laughs> well, you got to do what you got to do, you know. Where do you have a pit trap though? Yeah, we don't have that much removal, do we? We really don't. I'm just gonna take this. Go and do. Oh, glimpse boy. Angelic Accord, if you gain four more life this turn, create a 4 4 Angeli. Angeli with a flying. I don't think we have any way to gain life, really, except for the one per turn. Yeah, no. no. All right, we're out. I'm out. For that reason, I am also out. Uh, draws a card and turns creature. Okay. Target attacking creature gets plus one, plus one. I think it just might be 0 4. Just hold down the ground. Preventing one damage dealt to any target is really oppressive. We could have had two infantry veterans. Yeah, you're right. I'm surprised you remembered that. Yeah, there was one in, like, the Visions pack as well. Can't be blocked as long as you control a gate. Okay, well, that's hot trash. Uh, a Rubble Hulk is pretty sweet. Not for us. Not for us. None of these cards are very good. You are correct. It's gonna take that, whatever. Oh, here we go. How many things can we play? No, no. Oh, yes. Okay. What is that? It's a two one that gets first strike and plus one plus one if you control another multicolor permanent. Which is sad because we only have two others in our deck. But it's literally the only card that was actually playable for us in this whole pack, so. Two one for two is fine also. Yeah, it's still a two drop. It's a twelfth creature. I'm alright with it. Okay, Frazzle, counter a target non-blue spells, four mana, Rune Boggle. As long as it's enchanted, it has flying. We don't have any real enchantments for that guy. Cerebral Vortex was great for us. We do have a Boros Skilled Gate, actually. We could take Cerebral Vortex. I do like just drawing two cards, or like just dealing them some extra damage. Yeah, I'm gonna take Cerebral Vortex. Twiddle, I'm, I'm good. Crystal Rod. You know how I knew everything was bad in this pack? How? Because they were white borders. Because they had white borders. Oh, God. I'm going to take this in Rage. And just assume it's basically... Oh, that guy, the Suracur Nightblade didn't come back or whatever his name is. Take the Spires. Really? No. It's not terrible. Target creature can't block this turn. Morning Thrill? I think we only got one Spirit or Arcane spell, right? Get wrecked. That's really sad. We're so close. I guess I'll just take Join the Ranks. Join the Ranks, we have Marshall's Anthem. It could actually be decent. Tranquil Cove is good. As long as it has flying, as long as you go right away, right away permanent. That's actually pretty good. Plus two, plus two, and flying is pretty decent. I might just want the Tranquil Cove, though. It makes our mana a little bit easier. Yeah, Gilded Agus is nice. Oh, your mom went to a restaurant? That was sweet. I didn't. I never knew that. Hopefully you guys are okay. Hopefully that's not a super uh, devastating blow. I'm not sure if it was good or bad or... Look, we got an infantry veteran, inf infantry veteran back. I might just cut this Kalo Jushi. I don't know if he's making the cut. He was never meant to make the cut from day one. <laughs> he was not long for this deck. Guild Scorn Ward. I don't even know what this does. Protection multicolor? Yeah, all right, sure. Sammy, have a good afternoon, buddy. Thank you so much for uh, for changing your name and hanging out and letting me know about it. Appreciate it, buddy. Preach. You hear this ice chewing, dude? All right, so we need one cut. Oh, this guy's actually not terrible. 
We actually have quite a few enchantments now. Where are all our enchantments? We have Glaring Aegis. Saving Grace is an option. We could put recumbent bliss on our own uh on our own guy to give it to give it flying. Oh wow. Oh wow. What does that artifact do? Which one? There's like seven artifacts in the deck. This one? Nope. This one. Yeah. I literally went over this one. We picked it. Target blue creature gains shroud until end of turn. It's pretty good. Yeah, let's take out the Jushi, I guess. Oh, you're not going to show me the cards in my deck that are spirits. I think it's just this guy. What if we can play this guy and then bounce it with Deputy and then replay it to flip the Jushi? Just just get the Jushi out. <laughs> Jushi down. You don't think it's Jushi enough? No, not Jushi enough. <laughs> oh, crying out loud. So we have 12 creatures, but we also join the ranks. And we have uh, even the odds. Both of those go very, very well with Marshall's Anthem. I need one more cut, my dude. What's it going to be? Could just cut Vortex. Yeah, it makes your mana so much worse. We don't have a ton of card drawing, though, is my problem. We have, like, none. Just live that no card draw life. I mean, apparently I, we have to. Yeah, all right, whatever. No forest. Why would it say forest? Because we have a bant, a, de a bant sure blade, oh, which is. <laughs> so it's nine seven one. Yeah, that's about right. Uh, definitely, I'm okay with eight blue sources, but we do have double blue, double blue, and all of our white cards are single except for Marshall. I think we can just go nine nine. It's the thuggest ruggish ball. <gasps> what? Hold on. Benevolent Ancestor is a spirit. Oh, that could change everything. It's probably just better than Skyrider Training. We have no enchantments for this in the main deck. We don't? No. Done. Wow. That did it. That was it, man. I'm in it. Did you put him back in? Well, yeah, he's right here. Why do you hate the Kalo Jushi so much? Why do you say because it's dumb? <laughs> this is like an unprecedented level of hatred for this one two two. Five. I hate it. You were the one who even defended it. You're like it's you'll, a two two for three. You'll never flip it. Who cares? It's a two two for three, man. What are you doing over there? Stop messing with that. Stop touching everything. You're like a child. It doesn't do anything. It does actually. It makes this. It makes this wobble. Not if you tighten it. Well, yes. If you yeah, see that does that. That's literally exactly what it does. Not if you tighten it is correct, which is why I leave it tight. Well, you can do it either side. You can do lefty or righty. No, you can't. What yeah, are you talking about? Now it's tight. Other way. Now it's loose. No, it's not. Yes, it is. This moving back and forth is loose. Oh. Touche. There you go. You figured it I out. I learn something new every day. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I'm just going to save all these spirits. Come on. Callow Juicy right off the top. The funny thing is we can actually play we can play deputy to bounce one of these guys if we need to, to re-trigger, so. Dang it, Jushi. Where am I Jushi at? Look at all of our cards that do nothing. Wouldn't Pit Trap be good for the flash? I mean, is it really a trap if, like, they can see it coming from, like, a literal mile away? Let's pit trap that thing. Get I'll pit trap your face. 
They used to Actually, call you. Probably just better to deputy it. We probably could have just deputy what? Oh god, you don't know what deputy does, do you? Doesn't he detain something? Oh, you return your own guy. And that's not as good. Correct. I mean, I'm literally saying things like we can bounce our own guy to replay it. Well, just because you can bounce your own guy doesn't mean you can't bounce their guys. Okay, that's fair. I thought he was just a, a bouncy bro. You're a bouncy bro. It's the first of the month. Wake up, wake up. Who sings that song? <laughs> Bone Thugs and Blappany. Blappany? Mm -hmm. That was... Okay. Blappany. Bouncy Boy, still mad. <laughs> oh, man. Kurt sent me a message earlier, and he's like, hey, if you want to, you can just stay in my place for like three months. And I was like, that seems like a long time. And he's like, yeah, it's cool. Don't even worry about it. Um, hmm. It's the first of the month. Oh, next we're going to draw Kalajushi next turn, and then we're going to be able to play that into Benevolent Ancestor. It's gonna be. It's gonna be. It's gonna be huge. It's gonna be huge. What are they waiting for? No, oh, we did not draw it. So I guess we're gonna we're gonna throw our dreams away here, my dudes. <laughs> Done. Not anymore. <laughs> All right. Well. Now you can only stay for one month. Well, that's that's cruel, but I accept. It's gonna be mad. Why is the song stuck in my head now? Did someone say this? I did. Oh, Pernicious, did, did you say the... Did you sing it? Yeah, I did. God damn it. I didn't say May, but... What did you say? Uh, I forget, but it wasn't May. But it was the same tone. So. <laughs> it wasn't May. <laughs> it was the same tone, so that's all that really matters. Okay, well, whatever you want whatever you want to say, man. Whatever you want to do. Do we just get to eat this Nessian ass with our jugs? If they play a land though, then they get to pump it, and then it's really sad. Oh, but then they're gonna they're gonna oh this is gonna be great. Are you ready for this? I need I need you I need to know if you're ready for this. Oh, that's really good. Oh man, that's gas. Here we go. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Here we go. Here we go. Pack it up, pack it in. Let me begin. I'm going to win. I'm going to win. They're just going to chum block here? If you guys, if you have a way to give you like, four, five, six, seven, we can actually play this and then play Marshall's Anthem to get both of these guys back. What is going on right now? This is very confusing. Don't tell me to forget, not to forget the Ancestor. I Ancestor every day. I was born to Ancestor. Really? Instead of just pumping it, you're going to do this? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I figured you had two, because otherwise you're not going to block here. Sure. I mean, that's a lot of tricks. And this guy just gets... Do we just eat this guy? Wait, why did you add another card in there? Oh, because he... Because you had to? <laughs> just like three tricks? So, wait, 
like you lost a mighty leap, a giant growth, an unnatural predation, and an arbor elf for these two. Hmm. Fascinating. Value. Fascinating. Whenever you cast a spell that targets it, you'll see any target. Yeah, I mean, that's great and all, but boy, you just throw a bunch of tricks for that guy. Well, that guy's just a 5-5. Five, five. I feel like we just play that guy. I'm not gonna I'm gonna pay less than I'm gonna pay less than six though. I came to get down. So jump around. Can you jump around? Preach. I'm done. Okay. I am to get down. Get up, run up. <laughs> oh, God. Shut up and take my money. One fine jumping bug. <laughs> hey, man, good work. Wow, another trick? Okay, so I'll just prevent the damage I guess that's a good card okay would you like to come at me bro how much mana do we have four five six seven eight so we can activate this twice so we can get juggernaut and one other guy back okay I'll block here Assume you have another trick. This is just a ridiculous amount of tricks. So far we've seen one, two, three, four combat tricks. I guess this is kind of like a trick because they get to just kill your guy and still attack. The nice thing is if they want to do it if they want to use a combat trick here, we get to pit trap this guy. So this is a really weird attack. Return a card from your graveyard to its owner's hand. Sure. Oh my god, this is just using so many spells, dude. Okay, so now I'm going to pit trap this guy. <laughs> it's like a 10 for 1 again. Alright. So they used Titanic Growth, Naya Charm, and Nessian Asp, and we traded a pit trap and took 6. Seems good. It was even on board. It was definitely on board, yes. Now we can just recumbent bliss this guy. I'm tempted to just get back Juggernaut at this point and just deal like a million damage. Oh, uh, this guy. I'll just deal you 10. There you go. Don't forget the giant growth. What does that even mean? It's in the trash can. What is this, 4 4? You may have it assigned as combat damage. Sure. Well, I don't think that's going to do anything. Everybody into the red zone. And that's a GG for me, dog. You don't know. He could have fog. He had concede. Okay, he, let's say he has fog, then what? Then he wouldn't die. And then the next turn, what happens then? He'd probably die. Okay. <laughs> What's a, or do we have any like good stuff? For, like if they like, hey, oh my god, non-green creatures don't untap? Oh, that seems good, right? He did have a lot of green boys. Does it tap them down? No, it just says they don't untap. At the beginning of each player's upkeep, that player may choose any number of tapped non-green creatures they control and pay two for each one. That seems good. 
I think I joined the ranks. It's kind of annoying to play with, though. Yeah, but that's the whole point of these things. Like, you just want to play these annoying cards. Like, think about all the annoying cards to play with that are in the cube, you know? Yeah, but they're... I don't know, that just slows the game down. That's kind of what we want to do, so we can play with, like, this idiot. Oh, yeah, we're doing it. Why is he an idiot? He's not. I was rude. I'm sorry, Dojitai. They also... Oh, I didn't forget about the giant growth just because it kind of replaced itself with the Naya charm, right? So it was, like, the same... Like, they didn't they didn't net one. It's just, like, it wasn't, like, an extra card. It was just the, the, the Naya charm. It was essentially the Naya charm in terms of card quantity. And that was a good draw. Do we have any spirits? We have no spirits. But you could draw some. I could. I could draw some. Secret of the Way is pretty good with all the combat tricks. It just means we're never going to actually uh, win in combat here. I'm just going to play even the odds here. I guess that is an instant, so I could have actually cast that as an instant. But here we are. Well, you could risk it. For what, though, you think? The biscuit. Hmm. I see. They have four cards in hand. Do we just throw all three in front? Well, we use a bunch of tricks, so probably not. We also have Marshall's Anthem that we can just play next turn. Here comes Nessie and Asp. Yep. No, that's unfortunate. Uh, okay. Take it easy, money. Money? That was buddy and some other word that I don't know what I was trying to say there. Hmm. So if they play one giant growth, this guy's a 6-6. Six, six. Yeah, that's fine. They'll have to waste two tricks on this guy. Okay, sure. Wow. Wow. Alright, so they have one card in hand, but they do have a a decent board going here. We gain a life here, though, so that's pretty good. We gain one life. I don't know how we can win. I think they're actually way behind right now because of that life. Yep, no blocks. That's actually pretty good. One, two, three. And play Jushi. Play Jushi. There we go. We did it. Oh, no, they can pump it now. Oh, we're in. God, nothing ever. So what is this? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And this guy becomes. Oh, this guy becomes nine, actually. We can just double block. That's great. Thank you. Miss Fixin with the sub. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Welcome back. Yep, you got it. This is four hundred seventy nine, right? And this is becomes a nine 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 nine. Yep, seems good. All right, so if we can hit land, land, actually, I think we're in decent shape here. I don't think we're going to attack, though. I think we have late game locked down. And this is like combat trick dot deck over here. Look, it's a bear again. That bear is actually a little scary. No, it ain't. <laughs> That's, uh, JK. Uh, if you draw that, I guess. It's not, but... It's not. It Shut is up not. Take my money. Our Badger, forty-two dollars for reasons. Oh, we know the reasons. Badger, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. Really, uh, what is this? Is this is gonna fireball for seven. No. Okay, that's actually completely fine. Gaining life every single turn. I'm, I'm, I'm game. Well, 
I mean, if you can't draw... Now we're, now we're going to start attacking. If you can't draw lands, drawing four sixes are, is probably the next best thing. They didn't do anything, but they played this guy. All right. Well, that's pretty good. All right. Now we uh now we have a clock. If they draw five spells, they can just kill us. Oh, I guess we draw. We get a life each turn though. So. Six five flyer. Marshall's anthem. It's OP. Pretty good. Oh, Jatai. <laughs> it's OP. Oh, man. This is good stuff. Ten you in the air. And we're going to get a little greedy here and just play the Ojitai because we have no reason not to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So even if they had like bane fire they can only do it for nine so that's nice okay we did it all right our deck is pretty sweet oh they had sarah angel in hand why didn't they cast that i guess it wouldn't matter this turn all right i like it this deck is gas Well, you know what they say. Badger, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. What do they say? It's the Thuggish Rider's Ball. That's no. No one says that. It's the first of the mics. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Hey, man. You want some eye drops? No, I'm good. My eyes aren't really dry. You, you're probably drier than you think. Thoughts on face punches? Oh, wow. Pretty, pretty good. Pretty high. Wow. <laughs> Pretty good. Doug, have a good afternoon, buddy. I will join this match. Because I like playing Magic the Gathering. Could you guys hear the noise it made when I hit his face? It was like a... It was like a... It was a weird, like... Crinkly noise. A crinkly noise. That's all I got, man. I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> oh... I should have been chewing on that tinfoil. That's probably what it was. Mm -hmm. Alright, so... Felipe's out. Wow. it's rude. I guess just you and me then, my dude. It's the first of the mic. Wake up. Let's play this guy. Old crinkle faced McGee over here. Yeah, that's actually what yeah, that's what I've called him before. Oh, the mirror match. All right, now we are going to go. We're going to even the odds at the end of this turn. Even though the odds don't get even because they have... Only if you control fewer creatures? Oh, well, see. Actually, they play a guy, right? Yeah, we'll just wait. He's chewing ice hit him again. <laughs> Oh my god. Well, I'm all out of ice. I'm here to kick ass and chew ice, and I'm all out of ice. Like that? Yeah. That's Duke Nukem. Remember Duke Nukem? No, I have no idea. You have no idea? Of course I know who Duke Nukem is. Of course. I was, I was sitting in these I lands. I was raised great. by Duke Nukem. You were raised by Duke Nukem? Yeah. Duke Nukem was your dad? 
Yeah, man. Did was he? <laughs> I'm here to kick ass and smoke cigarettes, and I'm going to the store to get some cigarettes. <laughs> I'll be back soon. And then he never came back. God, where did you go, Dad? Daddy Duke Nukem? No, that's... That's Hoggish Gridley you're thinking of. <laughs> huh. A number I don't recognize is calling me. Answer it. Let's answer it right now. Can we do it? Sure. Put it on stream. <laughs> what, what are we doing here? The phone. Hello? Michael? Shut up and him. take my money. Okay. Hi, Mike. What is this? Ashley calling from AmScot. How are you? Oh, no. We're not going to do that. AmScot? Mm-hmm. What the hell? And there's a battlefield, you may tap target creature. Okay, I'll allow it. You just dropped your phone, <laughs> maybe. Yeah. Do you know who do you know what they're calling for? Nope. Weird. Well, you're okay with them. That's usually how that song goes. <sighs> He's like, yeah, no, we're not gonna do that. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Maybe my dad works at AIM, Scott. Hey, Michael, it's your dad. Actually, I don't really want to play this. I just kind of want to keep this up to counter their things. <laughs> Mike's like, nope, not doing that. <laughs> throw, my, <laughs> throw my phone on the ground. Oh, see you later. Dropped call. Wow. That's actually, that's pretty hilarious. Accurate. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so we're just double attacking here. I'll just take four here. I don't care about your nibbles. Your nibbles. Bobby, does your dad meow too? What does that even mean? Uh, oh, a 2-3 flyer? Mm, I think I'll just counter it. Counter target spell, unless it's control. This card this seems very good, right? So you return a land and they have to pay three more? Yeah. Else? Oh, that's pretty good. Pit Trap seems like it's not pulling its weight here. I agree with you. I kind of just want to drop this guy to just, to just have another body on the board. And we'll just say no. Let the body hit the Borg? Yeah. Wow. No, we're not doing anything with this this turn, so. just We'll just protect our Shroudy Boy. But it was not a Shroudy Boy until you protected it. I feel like we're doing well. You missed my massive donation and sweet idea? <laughs> One bone. Since this guy won't wear a shirt for a hat, maybe Mike can hook a shirt over his ears and have a shirt be... <laughs> you know, that is a good idea. What is like this? Hmm. Hold on. I'm holding. Nice. Looks like Ethan Klein. <laughs> nah, it doesn't work. So they block here, they take one, two, three, four, five, six. All their guys, literally every creature they played has flying so far. Sure, you go to four, and then I go to four. Let the bodies hit the floor. Mm -hmm. Requires an extra shirt. Thank you for the attempt. Mike gets us. <laughs> uh, excuse me. I feel like we're doing well. Things Frank says before it stops going well. Accurate. That is not inaccurate. 
Um, what was I going to say? I was going to say something that I forgot what it was. I don't know how I'm going to help you out with that. That's true. I guess you can't really. Oh, just one, huh? No, none. Just this guy. Okay. So if I move this onto here, you can block, block, and then you take five. Is that correct? And I still have mana to counter a thing if you do a thing. One, two, three. I think you're dead. Move you here. And then you go block, 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 and you take four. Right? Right. Got them. Okay, they have a bunch of floaty boys. Does that do anything for us? Nope. 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 Uh, deals see how much each creature dealt damage this turn. That's a nope from me, dog. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Spirit. Were any of those creatures spirits? I don't even remember. I just assumed the savant didn't have. Oh no, it's pretty good. Um, Skyra Trainee could be decent. <coughs> could it be? It could get float. I'll take out Pit Trap. This is bad. I know, dude. God, why do you like this? Don't we have like zero enchantments? In the, maybe. Maybe we don't. Maybe we have a lot. I can verify by looking right now. Okay, how many do we have? Zero. still a 3-3 Michael isn't that good enough for you is nothing good enough for you I guess it's fine <sighs> what about this guy oh, let's put infantry veteran in plus one plus one seems good it's only target attacking creature or whatever and Mike was it mean that when it became apparent that my boss had forgotten my birthday today that I went up to her and said I just want to say thanks for not making a big deal of my birthday today I don't think that's I don't think that comes across as mean because you could actually be mean it yeah I think that's fine what you gotta do is a Kelly Kapoor where you just freak out and get really. Oh mad my at god. Them. Oh, Kelly Kapoor. Spicy seafood ramen is changing. What's seafood about it? What fish bugs are in there? No. Oh, I'll keep it the sand. What sea bugs is in there? Okay. I'm not a big sea bug fan, I'll be honest with you. You're not a fan of anything from the sea. That's right. If it's from the sea, it's not for me. That's your motto. It kind of is. What about seaweed? Sure. Okay. <laughs> I'll choose your own guy. Here you go. You're welcome. I thought it would be on par with Bounce of Land, change the color of target spell. No, it's Bounce of Land, Mana Leak. It's real good. Oh, you milled two islands for me? Oh, biscuits. Oh, barrel shirts. I kind of just want to bounce these two. Barrel shirts. Yeah, it's Bounce Land Metallic Rebuke. That's right. That's right. Which, no, because Metallic Rebuke, you only have to pay two for it, not three, so. A little bit different. Bugs taste good. I disagree with you. However, you are Australian, so maybe. How do you know how, how many bugs have you had? I don't know what kind of cuisines you're into over there. Bug gene. 
Me? Yeah. None. I don't think I've ever eaten a bug. Uh, not in, not intentionally anyway. Not even a cricket or an ant? Not intentionally, no. I mean, they might have snuck it in my mouth while I was asleep or something, but... <laughs> oh, that old story, huh? <laughs> oh, that old chestnut. Oh, the old it snuck in my mouth while I was asleep bit. Thoughts on OP changes? Were there more OP changes? Did I miss them? Yeah, crickets really don't have much of a taste. They just taste really crispy. Do they? Yeah. No, we just drafted literally just Vial of Dragonfire and that was it. Which is still good. Mealworms kind of taste like chicken. I don't know. I don't know about all that. I think my problem with bugs is that they got juices inside them. And that's really where it falls off the line for me. Bugs have juices inside of them, and that's where they fall off the line for them. I think you just attack with the Sun Crown guy, right? Yeah, all right. Seems good. Humans have juices inside of them. <laughs> That's true. Thanks, aggravated cat. Humans are full of juices. Oh my god, literally all their creatures have flying or they just tap things down. I don't know what to do anymore. I could just play the Whisper Silk Cloak. I don't know why I didn't do that. I'm just like so tilted because I don't know how to get through this defense and my hand is not great. I don't think there's any way we can win this game. Really? Yeah. <laughs> that's a weird... Alright, well, that's something. They got too many floaty boys. Everything they have is flying. This guy's a little too good for us. He's too pure for this world. Elemental. This is a spirit. All right. That's good. One out of five. I think Hunter's sleeping and his legs are kicking. He's got the little leg kicks. Ding, ding, bang, ding, ding. Ding, ding. No, that's not what we're doing. Do you just crew and double block? Then they kill the skiff. I think it has to be done though. It's all I can do. Maybe they just maybe they maybe they uh order them poorly. Oof. Oof, that's brutal. That guy's doo doo. Yeah, we're just going to go to the next game here. Actually, we're 14. Let's not. All right. So they tapped down one of these guys. They attacked for three, four, five, six, seven. Don't know if you saw my message on Twitter, but I need to know which of your fun standards to play at my birthday tournament. Birthday tournament this weekend, please. Agree with Cheryl, I was okay. Uh, any standard deck? What are your options? The only problem with like fat dragons is that a we need one more for Ojitai, and if we draw citywide Sphinx or whatever it is, like this guy still taps it down. They don't have two cards in hand on their deck. Their, their board is not super oppressive right now. <sighs> oh, Invoke the Fire Mind. Seems good. I guess you drew, what? One, two, three, three cards? 
Yeah, that's pretty all right. Ojutai is seven. That's why I said we need one more mana for Ojutai. And if we draw Citywide Sphinx, didn't I say all this? Come on. Don't we have seven lands in play? We do have seven lands. Wow, I miscounted. I am not very bright. Kalo Jushi and Sandblast, sure. Seven land. Sounds good. It's weird because we actually have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven damage, and they're at, they'd go to four. Yeah, lethal though, right? No, well, not if we can block this guy. How are we dead on board? They have four damage in the air and we can block their stag. <laughs> Not dead on board. Okay, sounds good. Oh. Sounds good. Good times, good times. I bet Pam from the office was the Scranton Strangler. Wow. Mill two. Two planes. Woof. You're helping. Although they do have like a million mana. Do we have anything that can look like can we just kill them? It's not looking good. Interesting. We have one creature in our graveyard. That's pretty sad. And it doesn't even got float. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah, we're just... Yeah, that's game. And he doesn't even got float. He doesn't even got float. That is correct. I feel like we drew pretty poorly this game, though. Time to go for the gym and move heavy things around. Badger, have a good afternoon, buddy or night whatever time it may be over there make sure you get a lot of crickets in because you want to maximize your protein if you know what i mean i kind of want to bring this back in just because the the stupid elk is good enough stupid elk is good enough did you just have a stroke stroke of genius is that what you had no. No. The protein chick I use does include cricket. Really? Really? It's the thuggish, ruggish bone, okay? It's the first of the month. Wake up, wake, wake up, up, wake up. up. Can you just wake up? It's the first of the month, Michael. You've been sleeping all literally all <laughs> month. Please just wake up. He says as at my hospital bed. He's been asleep all month. I check. He comes back. Legend has it. He comes back every month on the first to check on little Michael. <laughs> <laughs> Will he be awake this week? Nobody knows. Oh, they just, oh, nice treasure map into one card. Gas. Nice. Didn't hit a land. Gas. Well, no, you get there with two on. I don't think so. What about when you come to 3-2? I don't think that's happening until turn 7,000. Ay, caramba. <laughs> don't say I caramba. Why not? <laughs> well, I'm not allowed to say that word. It's... Is that offensive to you? Yeah, it's offensive to me, you dollar store Bart Simpson. Ay, caramba a very common no it's not common. no one says I caramba I just did no that doesn't make it common no that card's good what if you're in Spanish land Spanish land yeah is that a theme park <laughs> yeah uh, it's, it's got many themes name one of them chocolate 
Chocolate is one of the themes. Yeah. I just wanted to say chocolate. Why? I don't know, because like, we'll say chocolate. That's what you say, you know? No. God, look at that little bug. This is so draining. Maybe we can just keep getting in there for free. I'm getting hungry. You getting hungry? I was born hungry, right? That's what you're yeah. going to say? Okay. Something like that. Coffee's pretty good at helping you wake up, but it's not very good at filling you up. It's the first of the month, Michael. I caramba. Wake up, wake up, wake up. I told you we should have taken get that up, frantic get search. Up, get up. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Steven, welcome back. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. 19 months well spent with the best mics around. Nice. Appreach. If you say preach, can you say appreach? I think so. Okay, I'm Since not. The word is appreciate. Yeah, but I don't know what. I don't know. Um, I don't know. What, I don't know what protocol is. You know what I mean? Protocol is what you make it. Hmm. <laughs> we know they have snap in hand, so that's fun. Snap's gonna get us. Ain't nothing gonna snap your face. Oh no, you got to keep on snapping. Oh, cool! Some birthday bucks. One hundred. Oh, sorry, I'm late to the party, but happy birthday, Mike. <laughs> Nice. Uh, you might have Mike confused. This is actually Bobby B Bobby Butter Butters. There you go. And uh, his birthday is not today, I don't think. But it was not Bobby Butters' birthday. Oh, that's good. I think we've dead. And they just snapped this guy. Snap it off. Snap it. I would just snap this guy and attack me for put me to four, man. Really? Come on, man. Just end it. Kill me. <laughs> end it. Did you remember to give Mike his birthday present? <laughs> oh, join the ranks. That's two non-floaty boys. This is like the first of the month all over again. No, I think we got this. I don't, you know, I don't you think You don't so. want to undo? I, I do, but I get the sorcery, so. Oh, now they just tap my guy down. This is so bad. I just, I'm not invested in this game, so it's really hard to, like, pretend we're gonna, not gonna do terribly here. Yep. Yep, now you get in for two. Unbelievable. We could just, so they'd be a ten, they'd be a ten if, let's see if it matters. I doubt it's gonna matter. If we win the game and they're at two life. Oh my god, stop playing things. And this is where we draw it. Yeah. Actually, it buys his time. It Bobby Butters his time. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> wow, is that the classic? Was that a double Jesus? It was a double Jesus. <laughs> you forgot to play the card. Oh, it's, it's an, an instant. instant. Okay. It's a, it's, it was a double Jesus. <laughs> a classic double Jesus. Oh, Lord. That's what's known as the old double Jesus, my friend. This is where like, I'll just counter this. You don't deserve it. What's my favorite kind of draft cube? Not even close. Not even close. God, Pit Trap just taunts me every game. I 
Why? Why would I like Cube the most? Because Cube is the most fun, yeah. You get to do the most ridiculous things. And you get to uh, play with cards that you don't often get to play with. And they're really powerful. And there's a lot of interaction. And, uh... and smoking. Smoking. That's from the mask. I want to mulligan this hand. Oh, here we go. Going down to five. Well, at least it'll be a fair game. There we go. That's a good one. All right, island on top. Thanks, preach. A preach. I mean, at least we got three answers. We got three removal spells in our hand. So, what does this thing do? Plus one target creature does one damage to any target. It's actually pretty good. I too have a weird artifact that you can sacrifice to deal damage. <laughs> My artifact also deals damage. Uh, I just want to play this guy. But think about the future Jushi McMushi value. Yeah, man. Think about that Jushi Mushi. <laughs> Buddy, I think about the Jushi Mushi every day. All right? Okay. Oh, gorilla tactics. Have you watched that Frank putting his hand somewhere in disbelief collection yet? I don't even know what that is. Is that a real... Wait, no way is that a real thing. Was it where was it posted? Oh, that's pretty nice if they play anything. Oh, the universe is a simulation one is great. Yeah, that, that video is gas. Oh, good. We get to even the odds now. Unfortunately, this is awkward because they just equip it and then they just start shooting down our guys. But, you know... What can you do? I guess if that's their whole turn. Sure. You got it. <laughs> Soldier boys, tell them. <laughs> You! He's gonna equip that Verdian longbow and kill our creatures. You! That's a soldier boy meme. Thank you. Alright, good talk. <sighs> what is this? Uh, for each card. Oh, God, I don't want this. But I need a fourth land, so I'm, I'd rather have an island so I can actually... Okay, well, I still accept. They didn't even win their clash. Was it book with land? Oh, nice. Two two, huh? Yep. What always you know always yes. Alright. That's pretty good. Oh, this guy gets renowned. I don't think we care about that. I will uh, however use a second blue because I feel like that's probably more relevant to being able to cast this. You why is this stuck in my head, man? Oh, never mind. I know why. Oh, wow. The the wait. What? Oh, they 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 put it on here and then they moved it over here. Yeah, this card's real good. Hmm. That is the thing, isn't it? All right. Well, what can you do? 
It's a common too? Jesus, Mirrodin. It's the first of the month. Yeah, now we're just going to bounce both these guys. Jeering instigator, jeering alligator. All right. Gain control of another dude when it untap, when it flips up. Sounds good. How about a land? Not a land. Two five drops in hand. Yep, you got it. You okay? Never. You're never okay? Never ever. Wow, that's kind of weird, man. You shut up. Why don't I shut up? Yeah. Huh. That's a good question. Before I get the hose again. You're going to get the hose again? Mm hmm. You're not going to give it to me? Nope. Going to get it. Never going to get it. God dang it. You know what I'm trying to do, Magic Online. Actually, we can just block, right? Is that better? If we crew and block, it forces them to shoot. Yeah, I guess this is fine. Sure. So, all right. Seems good. a good use of that ability. <laughs> and then the car starts flying and traveling through time when the music lands. Where we're going, we don't need lands. Wow, alright, so. Thank you. Boy, this longbow is really Eric, thanks so much for the somebody. buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. How you doing over there? You don't need no stinking badges. I just gotta keep checking up on you, man. I feel like this guy's big enough that we might actually have the, the fort held down at this point. That guy might do the job. Famous last words. We'll probably have something stupid like Savage Punch or something. What does that do? I don't know. I just It just sounded like it would do something. I'm sure there's a card It just sounded Savage like... Punch. I just named it. I just put a couple words together that sounded like it would do something. Savage. Someone in the chat bring up Savage Punch. There was a versus card called Savage Beatdown. It was one of the most valuable cards in the game. <laughs> you might have to be a little more specific. <laughs> I just put Savage Beatdown and it's just like a bunch of videos of people getting beaten up. Target attacker gets full slide of attack this turn. Okay, so this guy's a 3 3. I block with a 3 5. They go shoot it once. And they have clearly another way to deal damage to it. So I'm just going to take three here. Unless this is like the most... Um, the most epic epic bluff ever. 
which I don't think is a risk I'm really willing to take when I'm 20. Yeah, that's a big fat dude. Holy Jesus. It's a beefy boy. I keep forgetting we're gaining life every turn from this. It's okay, it remembers for you. What's turn three? Like, we played it on, like, turn three, so we'd be in, like, or to turn 13, rather, we'd gain, like, 10 life. It's pretty good. How do we beat that big boy? We have a pit trap right here. Does that just kill anything? Yeah, it just destroys the attacking creature without flying. Oh. Never mind. What did you think it did? What if he never attacks with it? Then we don't have to worry about it, do we? Yeah, but then we'll never be able to attack. We got floaty boys. We have to, Well, you didn't play it, though. Right, because I want to keep up pit traps so I don't take a thousand damage. Yeah, you'll be fine. Okay, we're done here. Fascinating. Sure. Eh, okay. Got bloodthirst guy? What is happening? You're just, oh, you're just going to deal all your damage this turn sure yeah this card's actually really really ridiculous to deal with oh it's Kalo Jushi. here he comes to save the day <laughs> it's not good really surprised at how much work this card is putting in. 3 3 first strike when you have a very longbow on board. Oh my god, what is this? Ulamog's Crusher? Oh my god. Yikes. That is a yikes for me, dog. How dare you call us fellow nerds? How dare you? Okay, so they've had a bunch of red creatures, really. I don't think this is that great against them, but maybe? I still think it's actually pretty good. Keeping their guys tapped down seems like it's better than nothing. <sighs> Why are you running? Why are you running? What is that from? This this meme. What meme is it? This is an African guy and he says a bunch of stuff. Cool story, man. Thanks, bro. If I could draw lands here, I'd be very okay with it. I'm going to put this five drop on the bottom. <coughs> Ancient what format story. is this? <laughs> no, you got a mountain, huh? Seems good. Well, see you later. All right, land, land, land. Three lands in a row. Four lands in a row. I'll take four lands in a row. Literally zero lands in a row. Okay, thank you. And this is how the game ends. Seems good. Oh, no. Well, it is a land, I guess. Whenever it deals combat damage, you may discard a card if you do draw a card. Sure, so it's just a... A rummager. A rummy in your bummy. <laughs> <laughs> no, no rummy in your bummy. It's not okay. What he's doing to you right now. Yikes. Wow. Well, we got big jugs. 
And we cannot lie. Bobby Butters, why would you say that? <laughs> What's wrong with you, Bobby Butters? Sure. Come on, white man, a white man, a white man, a white man, and no whammies, no whammies, no whammies, no whammies. That's literally the opposite, the exact opposite of a white mana. Well, it is a white card. God, you're so smart. Oh, they're just trading? Oh, God, that's great. That's all I've ever wanted. So does this seem like a game we'd be losing if we actually hit our two land drops that we missed? We'd have a five drop on board, we have a six drop on board. I don't think so. Huh. Does Mike drink alcohol through an enema tube? Um, that's up to him to divulge that information. <laughs> I also don't no. know what he does late at night when, it gets, when he gets alone. The old apple cider up the bum. Yeah, you found your white mana. I feel so. I feel so blessed. Hashtag. Hashtag blessed. I think we're actually in okay shape here. This also gets back two things if we hit like. I'm just gonna kill our guy with something, and then we're gonna die. Wow, that's you're pessimistic. I get that. Oh my god, I hate this card so much, dude. This card puts in work. It really does. It really does. <laughs> Heaven forbid I was able to catch the City Watch Sphinx. I kind of just want to play Deputy here so we can sneak a block. Sneak a block. All right. Let's say no. And let's block. Sure. One, two, three, four. Can't do. Oh, well, I guess we're just gonna play this guy. <clears throat> if we draw another white, we're just gonna play Marshall's Anthem and get back like Juggernaut or something. Yeah, this card's pretty insane. Please turn on your magic beeps. That's a big fat dude. Zoom do 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 do. Six two first strike haste is pretty good. I actually don't know how we win this game. Like, we can double block here, but then they go like, shoot this guy, and they're tapped out. So I guess we do get to eat. Yeah, actually, we're just going to double block here. Because they can only kill one of these guys because they're tapped out. So that's actually a fine trade. Because alternatively, they can go, like, shoot this guy, deal three to this, deal three to this, move this, shoot the, shoot the other guy. So being able to get this guy off the board now and being able to uh, 
Surveil too is nice. Oh wow, I want both of these. Um, put this on the top, put this on the top, and then we can actually get back City Watch Sphinx here and buff all our team. Yep, six five flyer seems good. How much of a clock do we put them on here? They have no cards in hand? Alright, yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about this guy. And we can play both of these cards next turn. This is a 3-3, three, three, this is a 1-5. Seems pretty good. Very nice. How much? Yeah, that's obnoxious, but I think at 14, I don't think we're really super concerned about it. How much what? Who knows? <sighs> Are you drunk? Every day, I know. Bitch, I might be. Okay. So you have no cards in hand. So you can shoot something and then re-equip and shoot something else. So that's two damage. So this would be three toughness. So I'll just block this guy and you're not able to kill this. I wonder if they forgot about the plus one, plus one. Because... Hmm. Okay, shoot my face. Unless they're just trying to maximize the damage, but then like, why wouldn't you attack with like this guy as well? I'm just gonna try to close out this game. and Benevolent Ancestor. Sure. I think 9 is safe enough. Because if they're tapping guys to attack, they're not shooting us either, so... And now they have to be able to deal with two of our flyers. Whew. This game is something else. I wish we had one answer to, like, an artifact, because... Good lord. We eked it out. What? We eked it out. We did eke it out. When it enters battlefield, all damage that would be dealt to you this turn is dealt to enchanted creature instead. I almost don't hate riot control. I think we just drew poorly. I think our deck's fine. Maybe. Plus O plus three is a trick though. Seems pretty good in this matchup to be honest. I'm just gonna play it like this. Uh I will keep this hand. Several plays. Alright, perfect. Want to, get, want to take a run my skiff? No. Why not? I don't trust it. Oh, that's too bad. You will one day. No. You'll trust it one day, it's Michael. It's a skiff, okay? That might as well be called a sunken. A sunken? Yeah. What does that even mean? Sunken these nuts. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That was, that was good, man. That's uh, real good. Got him. We're all. You didn't get anybody. <laughs> no one was gotten here today, my friend. Got him. You got it. The spider's back. 
Guess who's back? Spider's back. <clears throat> you didn't got a little armpit scratch? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the, the number of subs in the L tiers goal is pretty nice. Wow. It's nice. I feel like we're pretty okay here. I'm at a point where like if we just hit three lands right now, I'd be fine. You doing alright, man? Just my nose leaking, you know, other than that. It's really annoying, actually. You want me to cut it off? That, I don't think that will actually help. I think that'll just have a cavity. That'll still. No, I mean, you get cavities in your teeth, not in your nose, bro. <sighs> oh, <God>. Dummies. <sighs> What's going on here? Did they, con did they concede? Are they dead? some oh I missed it <laughs> oh I missed it alright they did they did a thing here hold on it said here are some bits for my favorite streamer and his sidekick hey sir thank you so much buddy really appreciate it I'm actually just getting this guy off the board now because it's always been a problem oh that was a good draw so now we can just play this guy And now I actually do feel like we're way ahead right now. That is fine. Let's win the clash. Bansher blade forest. Yes. And I can put the Bansher blade on the bottom because I don't actually care about it at all. Bottom. Because if this was a 5-3, it's significantly worse against our 3-5. But now we get to untap, keep up Sandblast and Adamant Will. And we get to hit another land. Woo! We're doing it. We're doing it. What was this guy last time? Steel guy? Steel gentleman? They're just going to do it immediately? No, they're just going to play two? Oh my god. Well. Hmm. Well, we can slam Ojitai, but we know they're going to steal it for at least a turn. We're 21. I guess that's true. Well, one of them is definitely a steely boy. I don't know what the other one is. Thankfully, because it's it's it's, it's a chaos draft, there's no way they could have two of the same card. Unless it was reprinted a different set, because there's only one pack. Pretty sure that's a unique Gabo from that set. Yeah, it definitely was. Your mom was also a pretty unique Gabo from that set. Wow. Why I never. He was a skater boy, said see you later boy. This is a bad dad and dude, might be. 5-2? Was there... Oh, there was a... Was that 5-2? No, that 5-2 had dash, right? Not morph. I'm pretty sure that was a dasher, not a morpher. I guess we'll find out. Candy Lurkers? Was it Candy Lurkers a morph? Oh, man. That makes sense, then. We just have to figure out which is which. I guess it doesn't matter, because we can just pluck either one with the Ojitai. There also was Wooly Loxodon. Was that with this match? That was this match, right? They played like... No, that was... I think that was a different match. 
No, that was definitely this match, right? Because they played a game one. I don't know, man. I can't okay. tell all these red green decks run together. Okay. Who, 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 who? So it's either six, seven, five, two, or two, one. No, that's not how that works. There we go. And those are the three we saw, so I have to assume it's some combination of those. They can't actually flip the 6-7. I think they're trying to figure out if they steal Ojitai, do they have profitable blocks? Or attacks, rather. And it could actually be like, they could just not have the steely guy, because otherwise I think he might just steal Ojitai immediately and get in there. And they do have it. Yep, this is what I figured they would do. But we do get our Ojitai back, and that will not be tapped. Unless they tap itself, but it's it's uh, it's an opponent control, so they can't actually tap the Ojitai, which is nice. They're probably going to tap this guy. All creatures able to block Nathalie do so. Sure. One, two, three, four, five. This is not. This is actually not that much damage. I mean, it's like fourteen. Mm, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Actually, that is that's more than I expected. Sure. I just have to block this guy, right? All creatures able to block Nasly do so. Yeah, all right. That's obnoxious. I mean, what can we do? We can't really play around this, and we can't, like, wait to get it on the board for them to use this guy. Maybe we could have. I don't know. But we get our Ojitai back, so that's pretty cool. That's pretty sweet, actually. Yeah, what a draw that would have been. Let's keep this idiot tapped. Wow, our whole hand is, is insane. Three, four, five, and we can play all of it. I don't actually know how we lose with this hand, but... NASA leaves, like, it's not a great card, but once you're on the receiving end of, like, having to block it with all your guys, it's pretty good. I don't have anybody to kill this, and I really don't want them to start looting if they don't have anything, so. Plus, Adamant Will on Ojitai is just... So all Both of these save Ojitai a lot of the time. Yep, that's a, that's a big dude. Guess I'm just tapping this guy down forever. Yeah, I don't want to get annihilated. Wow, Ojitai is a hell of a drug. <laughs> Alright, so we could have actually attacked with the Gearsmith, I think, as well, but... Like, if this is a 6-6, six, six, then we just, like, adamant will here. Actually, one thing we can do is block here. If they flip it, it's the 6-7. Uh, the we can just deputy and save this guy. Sure, don't care about that. Alright, that was your last card. That's pretty cool. We do have fewer creatures. Wow, that's insane when none of their guys have trample. And we have Adamant Will, so they're basically dead here. They'd have to, yeah, this is game. Whew. All right, Ojitai is a hell of a card. Our whole hand is instance. We have an, in an enchantment, a creature, and two instants, and they can all be played at instant speed. That'll do, pig. What was it? What was the flip? I guess I'll never know. You'll never know. I guess I will never know, actually. Where the hell is it? <laughs> 
So I go here and then I go return to game. It was it was a woolly locks it on. Sweet. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Send us like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on Twitch and Patreon. Links are in the description below. You can also check out meundies.com slash Frank Laporte. You'll get 15% off along with free shipping and free returns. And you guys have been awesome. Thank you so much for hanging out. Really appreciate it. I will see you next time.